Hey everybody, I'm going to do a quick tutorial today. I'm going to show you how to add your text to a circle so that it's curved. What you're going to do is click your circle, hold shift and drag. That gives you a perfect circle. And you see it's got a cut line in red. Once we add text to that, that'll change. So I'm just going to write something basic. So when you double click, you'll see this little cross right here. If you click on that and drag, bring it to your circle, your word will follow the path of the circle. Now you can see that the cut line is gray. It's not going to be there. It will cut still. I've accidentally done that, so I'll show you how to get rid of it though. Now, if we double click again, we have this bar right here. If you click on the bar, It'll bring your word up or down over the circle more. So if you wanted it inside the circle, you would just drag down. And you can see that the letters are really close together. So if you go over to your text bar and go to character spacing and push up on that, it'll push them out. You will have to fix the word on its curve a little bit after you do that. You can see it moving. If you want it to be faster, you can just uh, click in some numbers right here. You'll have to play with it till you find a good spacing. So now the curve changed because we added space to the letters. So then you would just realign it till you were happy with it. Now, if you want a word on the bottom, double click again now when you add it to the bottom it's going to go on the outside so if you wanted it on the inside what I do is I bring the word inside the circle close to the line here double click sometimes it works there we go and now it's there now I want it to go below the line so I will just drag it out like that all the way and I have good spacing and again if you wanted more space you would just go over to your character spacing again and change that now once you're satisfied with the words and how they are aligned if you delete this circle they're gonna go back well the top one will for whatever reason the bottom one stays I don't know but what you do to fix this so that this circle won't cut and you won't waste vinyl or HTV whatever you're using you want to highlight the word right click and click convert to path then you can go ahead and delete the circle do it to the bottom too so that we can get it to stay and then you can group them if you want it to stay as one piece um, but make sure that when you do that you're done typing, you're not going to change the font, whatever, because now that you've converted it to a path, it's no longer a font, it's an image, so you can't change the text at all. See, it won't even let me click on it because it's no longer a font. But that is how you would add your words to a curve and how you could cut them so that, especially with HTV, if we didn't convert it to a path and then we flipped it, they wouldn't stay, they would disappear. They would go straight again, not disappear. Uh, hope that helps. If you have any questions, just leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.